The offline VR function may be used to aid in creating a still image for inspecting parts. To activate the offline VR, select the camera and folder icon from the top toolbar on the right side. This opens the Own Images menu. This menu will be where any offline VR images will be stored once they are captured. To capture a new photo, select the camera icon on the left. When capturing your image, it is important to note the orientation of the camera. The same orientation will need to be used when applying the image to your element. Once your picture has been captured, you may exit back to the Visual Inspect home screen. Load the element that you plan to use. Open the tree view by selecting the icon in the bottom left of the screen. Double-click the title of the element, which can be found at the top of the element tree list. Select the camera icon from the dialog prompt menu. This will add an additional layer titled Camera Set. It will also prompt a list of all the images that have been taken using the camera tool. Select the image from the list to be used. Double tap the cam pause from the tree view to view a pencil, a transition from 2D to 3D, and a delete icon. If you do not see the 2D to 3D transition icon, the orientation of the image is not the same as it was when the photo was taken. Reorient the image and double tap the image icon again to locate the 2D to 3D icon. This image will be launched in the back of the element, along with a list of points in the top right of the screen. To merge the image and element, points will need to be taken on both the 2D as well as on the 3D level. Like using markers within Visual Inspect, the application will need to have a minimum of four key points to make the merge. The more, the better. 2D markers are selected by tapping the 2D key point. This will prompt a blue target, check mark, and directional icon. The directional icon is used to navigate the target and the check mark is used to define the key point within the target. This process is duplicated for a minimum of four points. 3D points may be specified using either the hand or the H icon. The hand icon is used to manually select a location on either the element or the image. The H icon is used to select one of the markers as a key point. Duplicate this process for each of the four points taken previously. Notice the dot with the term TOL in the upper right. This signifies that the image and element are out of tolerance. Now that four points have been made in both 2D and 3D, the TOL has been changed to AR. Click the AR to merge the two to form one element.